Aggregate demand is downward sloping. We were given the price level of 249 with consumption equals 6 trillion plus 0.75y, investment equals 3 trillion, government spending equals 2.9 trillion, net exports equals negative 0.6 trillion, with the equilibrium real GDP, GDP at price level 247 is 18 trillion dollars. Then we were given a price level of 240, consumption equals 6.2 trillion plus 0.75y, investments equals 3 trillion. Government spending equals 2.9 trillion, net exports equals negative 0.6 trillion, and the equilibrium real GDP at price level 240 is 19 trillion dollars. Aggregate demand and aggregate supply meet at equilibrium. This is the equilibrium for everything in the economy. The quantity represents GDP with a decrease in aggregate demand, and during a recession, the price level and GDP will both decrease. During a recession, it typically takes some kind of government intervention um, to get the economy through, even though the economy will correct itself over time. During a recession, we are not at full employment, which is why we are to the left of the LRAS curve or graph. This is there is a recessionary recessionary curve and could be produ- we could be producing more as an economy but can't because um, we are not at full employment. To fix the recession, we need to increase aggregate demand. The government can increase GDP by using fiscal policy, which could increase government spending or decrease taxes. They could also use monetary policy to to increase the money supply to increase investment. Fiscal policy affects consumption and government spending, while monetary policy affects investment. And as you can see on the graph, um, to correct the recession, we would need to increase the aggregate aggregate demand, which would shift the curve um, to the right. Um, So we're getting closer to full employment and um, the demand is increasing, which again could be due to some kind of government intervention, fiscal policy, or monetary policy. And to prove authenticity, there's a picture of myself on the left.